Colombia is notorious for having a very dangerous volcanic eruptions, not just because of the volcano itself. It is located, most of the volcanoes and the country of Colombia is located near or over the equator, but they have ice, they have permanent ice caps, some of them, and these ice caps are prone to melting. It's a lot of precipitation, and because they're five and a half kilometers tall, almost 5,300 meters, they have a permanent ice cap and glaciers. And these glaciers uh, are holding and pressurizing on the volcano. Earthquake happens, and the sides of the volcano, where the loose ash is actually held, uh, is practically collapsing. Then what happens is that the heat melts the ice, and you have a flood of ash mixed with the water, snow melted into water, creating flood. It's not uh, anything like uh, eruptions that we have in the Popocatépetl in Mexico, as you can see here. Even the amount of the sulfur dioxide uh, uh, sent to the atmosphere is minuscule compared to Popocatépetl, but the ice and the snow makes this volcano dangerous. We have the Galeras in 1992. It created a similar situation, an earthquake, uh, removed some of the mass, the volcano erupted, and we had this uh, death toll because of that in the uh, Colombia. Colombia, in that sense, is a very exotic country for volcanology and is studying ice.